Here are three things about Destiny's history you may not know about. Number one, there's a secret Zer and Tess Everest replacement called Yuna, who's only available on these South Korean servers. And it's not totally clear why they did this for only South Korea, but maybe there's some issues with Zer's tentacles. Number two, Ghost's original voice actor was Peter Dinklage, aka Dinklebot. And he was likely originally picked in the hype for Game of Thrones at the time, but was replaced by Nolan North around the Taken King DLC. And considering how often the community made fun of Dinklage's voice acting as Ghost, it's speculated that Bungie booted him for his mediocre performance. Number three, Destiny 1's original release was very shaky. Changes in leadership, writers, structure, and plans transformed the game into a Frankenstein stitched together mess on release. So much so that a lot of content was removed, like Mercury, Europa, Saturn's Dreadnought, SRL, etc. Many of which were depicted in early concept art and brought into the game later or in Destiny 2. Which doesn't mean that they held these back to sell them later. It's much more likely that their ambitious dreams got muddled along the way. 